A Christian is chosen by Jesus Christ. These powerful words echoed in a courtroom in Iran in 1994, spoken by none other than Pastor Mehdi Dibaj. Born into an upper-class Muslim family, Dibaj's life took a turn when he and his family converted to Christianity. His faith led him to translate Christian radio programs and literature into Farsi, the language of his people. In 1985, Dibaj was arrested and accused of apostasy for denying the Muslim faith. In Iran, the penalty for this crime was death. While the world outside moved on, Dibaj found himself in a cramped hole for two years, alone, with no room to stretch his legs. His wife, Azize, left him during this time, forced to marry a Muslim. Dibaj's faith, however, remained unbroken. He refused to deny his faith in Jesus Christ, which led the court to condemn him to death. Yet, a month later, he walked out of prison a free man, thanks to the international attention his case had garnered. Tragically, Dibaj was found dead in a park not long after his release. It's widely believed that Islamic leaders had called for his execution. But Dibaj's legacy lives on. His four children, despite losing their father, remained faithful to their Christian faith. Pastor Mehdi Dibaj's story is a testament to the power of faith and the courage to stand for one's beliefs, no matter the cost. His words, I prefer to know that God, the Almighty, is with me, even if it means that the whole world is against me, resonated across Iran and the world, inspiring many in the Christian community and beyond. His life serves as a beacon of hope for Christians in Iran and worldwide, demonstrating that faith can withstand even the harshest of persecutions. His legacy continues to inspire countless individuals to stand firm in their beliefs, reminding us all of the power of faith and the strength of the human spirit. In the face of adversity, Pastor Mehdi Dibaj chose faith over fear, love over hate, and God over the world. His story is a testament to the power of faith, the strength of the human spirit, and the enduring legacy of a man who chose Christ, even when the world was against him.